Hello, welcome to another Lightmatica Did You Know video. In this video, I'm going to cover the schematic verifier. It is a section of the mod that allows you to correct any mistakes in your build after you've gone through. I chose this build area and location because the schematic is quite large. It was edited before it was put into place and I omitted doing a number of things like tearing down this area that I'm standing on uh, the next couple of blocks down it would have been down to that very layer all the way through so these blocks will show up in the schematic verifier as being extra blocks and there's also some missing blocks throughout things of, of that nature and I'm gonna show you how to access those and, and take a look now, I currently have my rendering turned off so I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on now, I already ran the schematic verifier. You can see it in the bottom right hand corner, the schematic errors. I actually have it isolated to just one minute section. So to get to the schematic verifier, the hotkey is M plus V as in Victor. So I have to hit M twice because I have a map mod on as well. So, And here's the schematic verifier. I'm gonna go ahead and reset it. I'm gonna run it again. So just click start verify. And if I want to find just the extra blocks and nothing else, it's got a pretty big list here. I can isolate it to the extra blocks and it's not showing any in here. And then there should be extra blocks. Let me verify again. Okay, here we go. So I've got all of these and it's expecting to find error, but there's a white tulip in that place. I can click on this and it's going to highlight every one of them or I can click on just if I want to find just that one block uh, so I'm running this in a misnomer I did edit the schematic after I created in a backup copy of the world it had all of this stuff in it and I uh, the, basically all of this pre-existed regardless and I deleted it out of the schematic before I put it down so now as you can see I can actually go locate that block and it's expecting to find air um, let me do a free cam fly around here. It might be, there it is. And you can see there's the extra block. I actually put these in as an indicator of what is produced by that farm. Okay, say I would have the wrong block state. So if I wanna find any wrong blocks, they're listed here. And all of these are showing as incorrect. These are modifications I did after uh, the build was in place and any redstone tweaking, I adjusted things like that. If I wanted to do, well, I clicked on the wrong state, sorry, wrong block. So yeah, uh, I've got some chests in it that it expected to find, but there's stone that's actually in the world here and it'll highlight them. Okay, I actually have it. Snafu, sorry. Let me reset, start. I'm on the wrong block. I don't want to have all of those highlighted. And then the, I'm just going to go with the granite for the torch. And you can see there's a block right there. And then each block state is represented by a different color. So the wrong block will be red. Any wrong state of the block will be orange. I don't know that if I have... I don't know if it's going to be easy to locate. I'm just going to click on all of them here, which I had before. Yeah, all of these composters are actually in the wrong state because of the different fill levels when I created the schematic, and that is in orange. Any extra blocks are actually uh, magenta, or I think. Let's see. So extra blocks, yeah, they're kind of a magenta color. And then missing blocks, they're all in blue. So let me reset, start the verification, missing. Uh, apparently I have a ton of missing blocks. Okay, yeah, so for whatever reason, oh, I redesigned that redstone, that's why that's there. And there were some blocks I had in the backup copy of the world over there on the wall, uh, missing blocks all over the place, and you can see them. So if you have a large build, you went through, you build everything, and your material list is showing items that were not placed, you can actually use the verifier to track that down and put those blocks in place if you feel inclined to do so. Well, that will be all for this video. I do thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one.